Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. Alright, this is episode 32 of uh, Battle of Guandu, and uh, that's the fourth scenario in the game Romance of the Three Kingdoms 13. So what's happening that right now is that uh, apparently the alliance between Sun Quan and Sun Quan and Cao Cao has expired. So they are oh they just took over Guangling. Wow. And Guangling had has 31,000 soldiers. Whoa, that was a gift. So the problem with Cao Cao is that remember in the last episode we started to starve them out. And uh apparently uh yeah these guys are taking advantage of that. And they're going after Cao Cao. So what we're doing here is that we are I think we can uh, disperse Li Tai. To me. <clears throat> then we can have <coughs> We can have. <coughs> Sorry about that. <coughs> oh, they took back Guangling. Cool. That's interesting. They took back Guangling. Uh, I guess not for long, though. What? That's not very, uh, what do you call this, very... <laughs> okay. Sorry about that. Uh, okay, let's continue. Uh, wait, uh, we're trying to get... So they are not yet at gold. Okay, they should be gold. They should be golden very fast. And we swap. We move uh, Li Tai. <coughs> oh, no. sorry. We swap places here. Li Long uh, and uh, Xiang Yong. Because this place uh, cannot have, you know, at most it can it has a population of 166, while Hanzong has a population of 226, so they will naturally have a bigger population, and also the recruits every quarter is 954, so they're the same, so uh, Xiangyong will never get a decisive army that uh, Hanzong will will be able to field. And that's the reason why I moved, I swapped them. The person I, uh, the other person I swap is uh, Li Tai used to be in Tianshui, and so I swapped them also so that uh, Tianshui will now have twenty oh, uh, 38 or thirty-eight or thirty-nine, but here he still has a much bigger army. This is like fifty-one, so. <clears throat> Uh, again, this is a, this is a much bigger army, and uh, anyway, uh, so those are the things that I have done, and I've moved up Li, Li Shao from from Xinye. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, so I sent uh, Li Xiao to come over here to watch over uh, Luoyang. Uh, anyway, they are fighting over here, so we'll let them...
<sighs> and we are sending out uh, our big boss over here. So he's going over to Loyang. And uh, our mom is coming over here. How about this guy? So he's still not fully healed. He's not fully healed. Yeah, both of these guys are actually out here protecting. Yeah, protecting uh, Su Chang and uh, Runan. We can send her out also. Yeah, we're waiting for these two guys. And then, yeah, Cao Cao again. Cao Cao has the soldiers, just they don't hit, just they don't have the uh, supplies. So he always has to wait for uh, every quarter to get his supplies up, and then that's the only time he can actually march back out. Why? Okay, we're gold here now. Okay. I think we can now march out. Oh, we're waiting for these guys. This is Lee Nenny. I think the main army is out here, right? Yeah, he is out here. So it's it's very interesting that despite the fact that uh, okay let's just finish up the bow. <laughs> it's very interesting that uh, Cao Cao has very limited ability to sh uh, to sh uh, send out troops per city because of supplies right Sh supply shortage and uh, but he still has a lot of room to draw from and that's why it's interesting that a small s f faction like this uh, with uh, one two three four five six seven seven cities can put a uh, uh, has a hard time actually going up against a faction that has one, two, three, four. You know, I think it's still about 20 cities or 19. See, he still has all of these people here. He can still send them out. 
to mess with us. And over here, we've got gold. We got gold. We got gold. We got gold. Uh, how about here? Okay, we got gold. No. Okay. And we're watching our people as they slowly make their way up there. It's July. Oh, we did not ask him to join. Oh, he can join by we can if we use horses they'll get there very fast same here we can use horses here okay uh horses has as much uh elite horses has as much uh damage capability but they, they compared to elite spears uh they just lack a bit in terms of defense uh offense wise they are equivalent Harder. Who's Chao Chong? So they've snipped off Guangling. And then uh, on the north side, they are being harassed by Yuan Xiao. Population growth. Yeah, spears are so slow. Look at them. They're cr they're literally cr crawling. I think in another quarter he'll send them up. Okay. Wow, look at Chengdu. Chengdu will have 65,000. Whoa, look at that number. That is massive. Sorry about that. Sorry. Uh, where's this Yongchang? <laughs> Sorry. Uh. Oh, they're going for Xia Pi.
Yeah, this guy is going for Shapi and they are still concerned about us. We want Chen Liu, it has 38,000. <laughs> See, they don't have they don't have the resources to uh stand against us. Um uh, Okay, uh, who needs more training? I think we can send them out now. Oh, we need training here, definitely. Uh, how about here? Oh, no! <clears throat> how about... Sorry about that. Sorry. Mm. Military training. It's gold here. <laughs> oh. Okay, I think we can send them out now. This guy got horses. I think, uh, let's end September, October. Okay, let another quarter go. Let's see them fight off uh, this guy. Su Sheng. So do we have, I don't think we have any problem with uh, food stuff, right? Yeah, we're supporting an army here, another army here, an army there. So we don't have an issue, okay. Let's look at Shopee. Wow, that's 35,000. Shapi would be a good would be a good take for us. Chen Liu definitely. Puyang maybe not. We need to take Chen Liu. And then Hene here? Nope. Oh, Hene has Oh, yet yeah, has been totally uh what do you call this? They were like at 50,000 at one time. Okay, I think they lost a lot of their troops to us when uh, they were trying to defend uh, Hongnong, Chang'an, and and uh, yeah, and Su Chang. So Shapi would be a good one. So. Hmm. They're just waiting for the end of the month, uh, end of the quarter, like right now, so Chao Chao can now send out a ton of troops. So, it's just like that. Okay, let's save this.
What's the number two? Is it 25? That's our big boss right there, right? I think it's time to send these guys out. Okay, uh, one, two, and then we will have he will have and then maximum troops, right? And uh, we will go with if we see if we go with elite horse, our damage two ninety six one eighteen, as against elite spirit two ninety six one eighteen, as against elite spirit one uh, two ninety six one forty two. <coughs> so sorry about that. So the the uh, defense. It's big, 142. No, no, uh, no, no, uh, horse, 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 horse. 142 and 118, that's four, three, so 20, 20, 24, 25 difference in terms of defense. Offense wise, we're the same, but defense, not. This guy, I think they're horse. He is horse. Yeah. Okay, so he will go horse. We will go. Uh, we will go spear. And he's he's going to be at nineteen. Eighteen. We'll take everything. Right. How? Fun yong chen jin ba. Same here. We will deploy to here. From here. Fun tang. Uh. And Li Mei, right? And then we will have to Bandai. I Li Mei can take Mi Fang, Qin Min. So not as strong, but at least uh, we will go heavy spear, elite spear. We'll go elite spear. So we're still pretty strong. I think that's a good combination. That one, that one, and here. Our problem is that, uh, okay, we need to buy more, say, let's buy more food. Thirty thousand. Materials, buyer supplies. We can buy six hundred thousand.
What does it look like? Okay, we should, yeah, 200,000 a piece. So we should be able to, yeah, we should be able to do this. How about here? Uh, wow, he's still short. Okay, let's just go with, uh, let's just go with horses. Wait, uh, look at this. Oh, wow, look at that. Jeez. That's 67,000 that he, we can actually, uh, if we allow them to fully heal up. Wow. Okay, I guess we can wait a bit, right? Jeez, look at that. That was amazing. That's amazing. Okay. Uh, and we need three teams here. Uh, anybody left in Yeshua? Yeshua Yang Song Wow nobody left in Yeshua that is that we can move over Fang Jan uh, Jenning Not in Yongchang, but uh, not in one. Let's go to uh, the southern states. Uh, Changsha. Wuling, like Guiyang. Oh, they're already out there, Ling Ling. How about, uh, not Nanha Hepu, yeah. Because we're fielding, we're trying to field three teams from Chengdu. Anyway, our timer went off, so I guess this would be a good place to cut the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you join me in the next episode. Bye.